Uh, my name is Diana Nevarez, and I am a senior at McKendree University, um, a sociology major and ethnic studies minor. I received the 2017 MLK Humanitarian Award. Uh, it really was an honor to receive this award because I felt like I, I wouldn't even be in the position that I am without my support group or the people surrounding me that have supported me throughout my journey here at McKendree. You know, one of the things that Reverend Tracy, one of our speakers, brought up in the award ceremony is that uh, these leaders that we see on the forefront of these social justice issues always had uh, the community um, and the support of the people that really made these kind of things possible. So uh, accepting that award, I accepted that on, on behalf of not just myself, but the people that are right along with me, whether here at McKendree or um, throughout the nation. So on campus, we started an effort by creating a chapter of the Defend American Organization. That's a national organization started by uh, Jose Antonio Vargas and a few others, which basically focused on the media and culture regarding the topic of immigration and empowering uh, stories of immigrants by sharing their stories, focusing on, on the fact that these are people, and these are people that are very well integrated into our American society. And to kind of challenge what does it mean to be an American now, because we're in an emerging society where we are changing and those demographics are changing. Um, and we need to be prepared for that and accepting of that. So locally at, at our le level here at uh, McKendree University, I'm hoping that we we grow as a group, as a Defined American chapter, and hopefully get those stories out there of our members. President Trump winning the election definitely brought about fears uh, surrounding DACA, which is a Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals. You know, there's also a misinformation on, on what being here undocumented and documented means. This whole use of the term illegal immigrant, um, which, you know, people aren't illegal, actions can be illegal. But, um, you know, just getting people to be well informed on how everything works. I know even here at McKendree, um, people are unsure about how to approach me, um, but they don't realize, you know, I, I have a green card, um, as you call it, or legal permanent resident. Um, you know, I'm authorized to be here. Um, and just what we have as an immigration um, uh, plan for people to be here is it's, it's just not a very good one. Uh, the best one that, that kind of came out of that was DACA and that's threatened to be taken away. That hasn't, that hadn't been brought up until um, now this past weekend we saw the topic of immigration but uh, from other countries um, being talked about so there's that fear of uncertainty of, of what the next steps may be with, with that. Um, so there definitely needs to be reform. Uh, we're uncertain of what that's going to be. Um, but the fight doesn't stop there. This is a year of resistance. And again, some of the things that um, other people have fought very hard to get to this point, and we're not going to stop at this point and just let that be taken away. So.